Hey guys, I wanted to do this yesterday, but I was with family and was busy and, and didn't get around to it. My yesterday is your today. So I wanted to do this today. There's this really cool company called Death to Stock. I think they started off doing uh, stock photography that isn't stock photography. Just look them up, you'll see what I mean. Stock photography looks like this. <coughs> yep, fairly terrible, borderline obnoxious. Death to Stock offers stock photography that doesn't look like garbage. Lately they've been providing other assets. So they offer this really cool USB stick that comes preloaded with assets that essentially jumpstart your brain with cool ideas. And then the other thing they offer is um, they just started it and I'm really excited about it and I'm gonna kind of piggyback off of what they're calling writing prompts. I think they're monthly, but hopefully they're more frequent than that, we'll find out. But essentially they offer, again, an idea that spark an idea in your brain and you begin writing about them. Um, but we're gonna kind of steal that here and um, use it to uh, use it as a platform for dialogue. This first one is called Obstacle and Path. The idea being behind entrepreneurs, designers, creatives, thinkers, there tends to be a path and there turn ten, there tends to be a path and then there tends to be an obstacle in that path. And the question from them is, what is your, your most frequent or your greatest obstacle that you have to overcome? For me, if I haven't talked about this already, I probably will at some point in the vlogs, probably more than once. The biggest obstacle from my perspective is fear. So I kind of wanted to talk about this the other day with my, my friends Adam and Tony on the vlog, but I spaced and totally forgot. Um, but the idea of you know, how they got started, they had no experience in this stuff, um, but that did not hold them back. They found something that they were interested in and dove in head first. I try not to be a do as I say, not as I do type of person. When it comes to fear though, that's one of the biggest things that holds me back, which kind of makes sense, but from the surface, uh, it doesn't really appear as fear. Oftentimes what happens though is we have an, this outside perspective when you haven't jumped in yet. We, we look at these tasks or these pursuits from the outside and they can instill fear in us and they hold us back and they keep us from moving forward, taking that first step. For me personally, fear is something that I'm constantly having to overcome. It doesn't matter what the path is, fear always creeps in. So for fear or whatever your obstacle might be, there isn't a formula. Oftentimes, you just have to take that first step and dive in. Just taking that first step is almost always the best way to overcome an obstacle, regardless of whether you know how to attack something or not. Standing still is no better than moving backwards. Whatever your obstacle is, take a breath, assess the situation, and just move forward. If something doesn't work, that's okay. Attack it from another angle. Do more research. Talk to more people. Stop holding yourself back. Uh, I think that's all. Yeah. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions or comments, put them below. I'll see you guys next time. It's a monsoon.